So tonight, because it's the Doctor Who special, we had this idea to do. I had, I had written that we had the Doctor Who theme music, and uh, and I had written some words over the top of it, and we all did a dance number, and we rehearsed it. Last two days, we've been rehearsing it. Rehearsed it like crazy. It was awesome. We were dancing around. The puppets were in it. It was like, ooh, and I, you know, I did a whole big thing, because I know you enjoy the puppet intros, and to be honest, I enjoy them too. And look, these guys don't dress like this all the time. Well, he does, but nobody else does. <laughs> So anyway, five minutes before we start tonight, I'm not kidding, five minutes, the producers, and I use the term loosely, <laughs> come to me and say, uh, Craig, we haven't got legal clearance to use the song. Oh. That's the noise I made. <laughs> and then I made a noise that you probably wouldn't make. <laughs> not if you're a lady. <laughs> I said, you... What's that coming to go? What's that coming to go? Tootsie Fruitsie. But luckily I didn't let it affect me or make me angry in any way. <laughs> By the way, this is Doctor Who's uh, uh, magic pen. I look forward to your corrections. Uh, I know what it is. Anyway, this is what I'm going to use on the nuts of the people that produce this show. <laughs> Don't get all, you know. Anyway, so here's the thing. Uh, we're, we're only uh, legally entitled to do uh, a much uh, scaled down version of our dance number. So you ready, everybody? Do I look excited to you? Because I'm cock-a-hoop. Is that code? <laughs> no, no. It's, In your pants. No, no, it's too late now. Anyway, look, here's the thing. Uh, uh, way back in November of last year, right, we had a Doctor Who special. Doctor Who is a show that, uh, anyway, we had a Doctor Who, if you don't know what it is, bear with me, because you'll find out when the, look, we had a Doctor Who special. <laughs> and we had this musical number that I wanted to play, and we couldn't play it because we couldn't get the music cleared in time. I found this out about three minutes before we went on air. Thanks. <laughs> Anyway, the good news is, very quickly afterwards, as in now, we finally cleared the music. Now, normally we don't rehearse anything on this show, but because this thing was complicated, we shot the rehearsal, we actually filmed it, and then a, a copy of that leaked onto the internet. I was furious. <laughs> for legal reasons, but, <laughs> but now we've cleared the music and we can actually play it, so you can actually see what I meant to show you on, the, which is interesting because one of the major act, actors, uh, actresses on the Doctor Who show, which is a very famous British show, is on the show later tonight after Gary Sinise, Alex Kingston is here who played, well, you'll find out. Anyway, the, well, you, now you know, in fact, because I told you. <laughs> anyway, the point is, uh, I have the Doctor Who cold open that we were going to show, the dance number, and now you can see it if you watch this. <laughs> Tonight's show is a little different. Tonight's show is about a man who's not really a man. He's a doctor, but he's not really a doctor. Like Dr. Phil, but awesome. <laughs> Most people in the United States of America have not heard of him. He's just like me in that regard. Who is he? He's the doctor.
Rabbit's character, my brain. Rabbit friend. Ooh, tell me more. The show has been running for almost 50 years. With many different actors in the role of the doctor. The doctor doesn't die, he just regenerates. The crocodile alligator speaks the truth. in this giant explosion in which we inhabit, then surely that's it. Intellect and romance triumph over brute force and cynicism. Right, Doctor? Absolutely. <laughs>